Here we are at the mining show again with yet another beautiful story I didn't know about. Thanks for coming by today. Thank you, Peter. We are talking about Madagascar, and we're talking about Next Source Materials, which has a graphite deposit in Madagascar. Yes. So let me set the scene. People come in to talk about mining. I ask about 43 101s. We did this before the interview, and you told me you actually had a full feasibility study, and you're in development for your mill now. Yes, so the mine, right now we were raising the money, so we've been in Madagascar 10 years, done two feasibility studies, recently updated our feasibility study in June, right. which we announced to the market we're building the world's first fully modular mine. And what okay. that, what so that stop, means... Pause there. The old one called for $200 million a capex. Correct. The modular mine calls for? 20 million in 20 capex. Million. Now the volume is 50,000 originally. We're bringing it down to 17 as a phase one. Phase two will be the full 50,000. Tons? But tons a year, which makes even a 17,000 ton mine is still probably the fourth largest in the world. So this is a very high quality. All our graphite has been tested already by end users. So it's been verified. Our stage right now is to raise the $20 million US to build the mine, we can have an up and running in nine months time. How we can do that is because it's modular. It's being built off site. It'll then be sent to Madagascar, constructed, reassembled right. in about 30 days time. So your labor cost is less? Housing cost is less? We don't have, yes, we don't have to house all these expensive, you know, it's 1,500 people was original uh, to bring them down to Madagascar, feed right. them sanitation, house them, and now we can build it offshore in a first world country. People, you know, go home to their families at night and then it gets shipped and this is incredibly, incredibly efficient. So that's one of the biggest savings for us is to be able to have it sent and it's basically connected like a Lego set. So this has never been done before in mining where the full mine has been built in a modular form. So this is game changing to us because this can it's be applied. An incredible it can be applied in any jurisdiction, any commodity. So this is a it's a de-risking exercise, it's a proof of concept. When we right. build this phase, then we intend on using it to do our other opportunities, which are vanadium. We have the big vanadium deposit as well, 10 kilometers away from our graphite. In Madagascar as in well. In Madagascar. So these oh. are all 43101 compliant, and our graphite, of course, is a development stage. It's Detailed engineering is completed. We're just all we need is the money to start building. So, are you looking for debt, equity, or both? It'll be equity. It's so small. I mean, the debt side. Uh, we already have the debt lined up for the expansion. So, right. once that, once we get phase one, which will be done in equity, it's such a small ticket. Then we can have the debt side pay for the expansion, which is phase two, and then we become a very, very sizable mine. Yeah. It's funny we talk about twenty million dollars being a small ticket, but compared to a half billion for to develop a mine. 20 million is nothing. No, it's not. And we've actually invested 50 million US dollars into Madagascar to date, just developing both the graphite and the vanadium. So here and, we are. And for CSR, of course. Of course. And 20 million, I mean, uh, that's for us. I and mean, that, that puts us in production. It generates revenue. And it's a very, very high quality asset. When are you in production? Uh, so it's nine months of construction and delivery and assembly time from the point we are funded. So if we are funded by May 1st, we're in production end of December. It's that easy. I wouldn't say it's that easy, but it's well, it's uh, it took us 18 months to do all the value engineering to connect all the pieces to actually get this concept, and that we want to show the world, show the investors, show the funds, show the mining world that this is actually going to be the first modular mine built, and we can do it on time, on budget. Wow. Well, you look at Northern Ontario. The rough metric is $100,000 a meter. So if you're going down half a kilometer for shafting, it's half a billion dollars. Yeah, ours is open pit, so again, we're not anywhere near. In Madagascar, you have to be concerned about the, uh, the, the jungle and the rainforest. We're not anywhere near that. This is open pit. We have no environmental concerns. Uh, there's no fam uh, villages around us. So this is just a flat, open pit, perfect mining setting. It looks like Nevada. So we're very blessed by the fact that we're not in the endemic areas of Madagascar, and this is going to be, for us, uh, a blessing because uh, it can certainly be a concern if you're in the rain rainforest, which we are not. So if you're in development, you must have end customers for your graphite. Yes, so all that is, all of our graphite is spoken for. Uh, we can't, it's again confidential. We want to get that out to the market soon as we... Did you get any offtakes for that? Yes, yeah, okay. yeah, all that's in place and we hope to announce that to the market as soon as we uh, get ourselves funded because uh, that, that'll be the requirement for us to, to be able to press release who the, who the parties are involved. Great story. So, uh, I, I we're really excited to get going. Coming by, Brent. Yeah, well thank you very much. Have a great day. Thank you, Peter.